the following six-man tag team match is scheduled for one fall. On the way to the ring, from Los Angeles, California, Melina. Florida, Michelle Miku. Great White North is about to heat up, and
as ECW is live from Montreal, Quebec, Canada. ECW in Canada go together like brass knuckles and broken jaws, baby. This one's gonna be off the hook. <laughs> You're a poet. The people of Montreal are in for a spectacle the likes of which they've never seen. Great reversal. How do you compare today's superstars with those when you were active Why? in the ring? Not like I'm uh, Ed the Strangler Lewis over here. I've been in the ring with a lot of guys on that WWE roster. Hey, my mistake. I guess it just feels like you've been out of action longer because I have to sit next to you week after week after week. I'd say this matchup has lived up to expectations so far. What do you think, partner? Yeah, it's off the chain for sure. I'll tell you that right now. I can't wait to see a quick tag. See now, that's smart strategy. I think we're hearing the First Amendment in action here tonight. Freedom of speech is definitely a cool thing, and we're getting a perfect example of it right now. They got the tag. I really wish all the other divas would stop being so jealous of Melina. They just got to realize they'll never be as good as her. Just because Melina says she's better than them doesn't make it true. She's hotter in a desert and three times as beautiful. What other lady can compete with that? That was a smart tag. a really good time to start wearing down a body part. I say go for the leg. Sound like a manager. You ever considered that career path? Nah, I'd be too careful to jump in that ring and start choking people out. It sure was a long, strange trip to get these superstars to square off like this. No doubt, the shortest distance between two points may be a straight line, but I find this way more entertaining. I'm with you, partner. And now they're here to put on a great show for all of us. Uh. Hey, what's the deal with Tori's dog? She's always carrying this thing all over the place. What's up with that? You mean Chloe? I have to switch up partners. Ashley may look like a kitten, but she fights like a tiger. <laughs> To be honest, I think my favorite is when she uh, purrs. What a counter that was! I don't get why people don't cheer Candace more. What do fans got against a beautiful chick like this? I think they have something against beautiful women who break the rules, specifically. Man, you just can't put anything over on these fans. You sure can't. They see everything, and they'll let you know about it. At 5 feet, 10 inches tall, Michelle McCool is one tall diva. The only reason she wears high heels is to use them as weapons. I'm sick of you ripping on Michelle. Let's face it, she's an educated professional lady. Quit trying to bring her down, you insecure chauvinist pig. Here's the pin! One, two. Well, have you ever seen a more attractive exhibitionist than Kelly Kelly? Honestly, Styles, besides you, I think Kelly's the only exhibitionist I've ever met. Exhibitionist, Taz. She's an exhibitionist. tight. You need a tissue or something? They made the tag, and here we go! What a reversal! <laughs> this could be three right here! Whoa! I think these fans have got a little something they want to share with us. They paid for their tickets, and that gives them the right to have their voices heard.
They sacrificed everything to get to this one match. That's some hardcore drama right there. Sure is. That's what makes sports entertainment so compelling. Well, that and having me on the mic. Yeah, right. How could I forget that all-important aspect? This capacity crowd definitely has their favorite in this contest. Having respect and support of the crowd is great, but it's not going to win you the match. Didn't it give you a rush to hear the fans cheering and chanting for you? Yeah, I think it's pretty cool. You know, there is such a thing as playing to the crowd a little too much, and that's exactly what I'm seeing here. If you can flip... There's the tag. Nice teamwork. So much can go wrong from that top turnbuckle. You know, instead of showing off to the fans, maybe you should really keep your head to this match. Do I detect a uh, tinge of jealousy? Maybe you didn't always get that kind of reaction from the audience. Ugh. Molina is like the sirens of ancient mythology, using her seductive charm. Oh man, there's the tag! The tag is made! Boy, I'll tell you, that Tori Wilson is one hot mamacita. Glad to see those Spanish lessons are really paying off, partner. Ah! I gotta tell you, I was so pumped up about this match, I hardly slept last night. Are you sure your own snoring didn't keep waking you up? Hey, I don't snore. Wait a minute, you forget, I've been on planes with you. Either you were snoring, or you swallowed a chainsaw and catering. Wow, great reversal. Did you see Ashley's spread in Playboy? Oh yeah, I got the issue, but I only uh, I only read the articles, you know. Look at that, that's gonna go over big with the fans and build some momentum at the same time. You really gotta watch out for your opponent when they get fired up like this. The adrenaline is pumping, the crowd is coming alive. This is what they came to see. Whoa, calm down there a little bit, Twinkle Toes. You're gonna leave a puddle. <laughs> and there's the tag. Come on, you don't win a match by taunting your opponent. Not technically, but getting the crowd on your side can be a huge psychological boost. Who do you think has the advantage in this matchup? It's too close to call. It all falls down to who wants it the most and what they're willing to sacrifice to get it. We're not in the ring. You gotta be careful when you're going up there. This superstar is all fired up, and so is this capacity crowd. Yeah, well, I'll tell you what, one mistake and we're gonna see that fire go out pronto. Michelle McCool is one smart cookie. She taught sixth grade before coming to WWE. That's two. Looks like a tag to me. I'm not one to judge a match with stars, but this one is off the chain. I agree. I think someone's been taking flying lessons. Kelly has grabbed the attention of both the fans and the performance. Yeah, it's not hard to see why. Just look at it. Uh, I'm sorry. Were you saying something? <laughs> Looks like they've come in. On the mat. Shoulders down. One. This could be it. Two. I was talking to one of these superstars before the show, and they let me in on a little secret strategy we're planning for tonight. And that strategy was? If I told you, it wouldn't be a secret, now would it? Jeez. No wonder why nobody trusts you. I've seen matches won and lost because of moves like this. The 
these competitors seem a little tentative in there. If you took the bumps and bruises they did, you would be too. I guess going up the turnbuckle hurts a heck of a lot less than coming down from the turnbuckle. This could be big, but it could backfire real bad too. I don't get it. Why not go in for the kill? I think this superstar has a game plan and is determined to stick to it. That's all well and good, but what you think up in the locker room and what happens in a match are two different things. And there's the reversal. That tag shows some talk about adding insult to injury, and these fans look. Yeah, well, you know what? He better worry more about the injury and less about the insult until this match is over. The crowd has certainly given the referee saw the tag. I don't remember the last time I was so excited about a match. I hear you. Electricity is in the air, and these superstars are doing everything they can to harness it. about becoming a wrestler, or what they call in this company, an in-ring competitor. Uh, considering the fact that I'm afraid of my wife, I haven't really thought about that much. I don't know, man. You'd be <laughs> tough to catch in that ring. Kind of like a greased-up shaved cat with mayonnaise on its face. You feel like a real jerk when somebody <laughs> counters you like that. Looks like the tag has been made. They get the tag? Yes! I think everyone's gonna leave the arena with a smile on their right. face. Not everyone. Remember, someone's gotta lose, and losing's not fun. Good point. That top rope moves can win or cost you the match. There's no middle ground about it. What's the key to this time in the match? You can't... Whoa! That's not cool. Seeing your opponent's finisher like that. How lucky are we to have the best seat in the house for this match? This is what it's all about. Being front row for the best sports entertainment action on the planet. And there's the pin! Whoever thought we'd be calling this match together? Hey, partner? No fooling. Hey, not for nothing. I wonder who I got heat with to be stuck with you. <laughs> Melina is more than just a great manager. She's got some chops as an in-ring performer also. Of course. If you can cheat to get someone else the win, you can cheat to get the win for yourself too. I'll tell you what, that Tory Wilson, oh, that. I think that's a tag. You women have embraced the WWE diva lifestyle like Ashley has. And there are few women these fans want to embrace more than Ashley. We do have a smart audience, that's for sure. Candace suffered a broken nose in the ring back in November of 2006, but returned to action only a month later. You can't keep a good girl down, <laughs> unless you try. In her case, I guess you can't keep a bad girl down either. Damn, I'm funny. Time for some fresh meat to come in. That was a textbook reversal. What kind of preparation goes into a match like this? What? Besides the endless world... Oh boy, looks like someone's moving up in the world. I hope the fans know they're getting something special tonight. They better. Here's the cover! One. Two. 
Michelle McCool is a former Diva Search contestant who's now become a very successful performer. She may have not have won the Diva Search competition, but she did earn a job here in the WWE. We got a pinfall attempt right here. One, two. It looks like there's a beating of the minds going on in there right now. Get it? Look at this. You don't often see a superstar's signature move used against them like this. This kind of seems like a good time for a snack. Hey, you know what? Why don't you make yourself useful? Go get me a hot dog. You know what? You're not going to last very long in this company with that horrible attitude. What happened to the bright-eyed, bushy-tailed go-getter I used to know? He went and got himself a spine, thank you very much. This has match of the year candidate written all over it. These superstars never stop trying to outdo themselves. Ah! Kelly Kelly is just as sweet in person as she is pretty. She does look great in the ring, that's for sure, but that doesn't exactly win matches, you know what I'm saying? Only you can see a girl like Kelly. Here's the pin, this could be it. One, two. You know, I had no idea things would go the way they have here tonight. You said it, partner. Neither did I. Yeah, but I'm smarter than you, so basically it means more than I said. The fans have sure been treated to some great action tonight. You bet. This is a night they're going to be talking about for a long time. Superstars are like machines in there. Machines, I say. I'm sure that means a lot to them, coming from a human suplex machine. What can I say? It takes one and no one. You have to remember, even when the action slows down in the ring, there's a battle going on inside these competitors' heads. What are you, a mind reader now? How do you know that? Look at them. There's a definite test of wills going on as we speak. You're full of it. They look like they're having a little indigestion to me. When Melina emits that banshee-like howl, she can peel the paint off the walls. That's what a real woman does. Melina is 100% real woman, kind of like you. What's your favorite hardcore weapon? I've always believed the pen was mightier than the sword. I'll tell you what then. You get a pen, I'll take a sword, we'll see who wins. Matter of fact, since we're talking about it, you can have them both. Okay, Captain Cordial, what's your favorite weapon? I actually like a good kendo stick swat right to the head. Right in the point to the head, actually. It's like a hardcore version of a fly swat. Alert the authority! Someone just stole their opponent's signature maneuver! There is no love lost in that ring tonight. Yeah, each competitor has talked a lot of trash about the other. They better hope they didn't write a check with their mouth. Their pooley can't cash. Ha <laughs> pooley. I think they've proven that they have what it takes to hold their own in battle. These guys are tough to figure out. What are they doing? I think that's the point. If you're unpredictable, you can catch your opponent off guard. You may be. Boom! Gotcha! <laughs> I guess you're right, jerk. Thanks for proving my point. I need to change my pants during the next Talking episode. about getting a taste of your own medicine. I don't know who's more excited. Me, the fans, or the superstars themselves. I'm gonna have to go out on a limb here and see I'm the most excited. You got a problem with that? A high-risk maneuver in the works from that top turnbuckle. Tori Wilson is one decorated diva. Miss Galaxy winner, Playboy cover girl. Yeah, and she's no slouch between the ropes, neither. She certainly isn't. 
tremendous performer and a pretty nice person to boot. She's a total package. Looks not to love. Ashley is one diva who's very easy on the eyes, let me tell you. She's got an extensive gymnastic background too, though, which means she can hold her own in the ring. I don't care what she does in the ring as long as I get to watch. Candace has been known to use that wand like Finley uses his shillelagh as a weapon. You're such a whiner, you know that? You just whine, like a little baby. I bet you used to be like one of those kids that rattled up the other kids who were cheating on the test. You're a whiner! I just don't think it's right for some competitors to use uh, international objects as dangerous weapons. Is it too much to ask to have a fair fight? You mean like the fights you got into when your classmates found out you told on them? And then they beat you up after school? <laughs> Man, this match kind of makes me miss competing in the ring myself. I wouldn't jump in there right now. Those superstars are really going at it. Maybe you're right. How about I just... This is a big risk. Will it pay off? <laughs> what a night of action, and I have a feeling the best is still yet to come. I'm digging it, too. And you know what? What would make this thing much better is if you maybe just kind of like pipe down a little bit so I can pay more attention to this We're here to provide commentary. Talking's kind of our job. Then maybe I'll have to break out my mute button. Also known as my fist. And the crowd has come alive tonight with a chant directed at the superstars of the ring. Well, I sure wasn't expecting to sit on their hands the whole night. One. Michelle McCool is one vicious diva. Just as soon stab you in the back than bat those baby blues at you. Hey, relax. Just because she's more woman than you, don't get upset over that. I know better than to try and pet a tight. That's all I'm gonna say. What's going through the minds of these combatants right now? About a million different things. Here's the deal, you gotta think several steps ahead of your opponent, especially in this caliber of a match. It really is a game of human chess. Yeah, and I'm stuck next to the lowly pawn. Hey, why in the hell did Kelly's parents give her the same name twice? Kelly Kelly, that's like you, Joey Joey. I don't know. Maybe Mr. and Mrs. Kelly had a feeling that their daughter would have trouble remembering two names. I got my favorite in this match, but something tells me I can... Oh, man! I guess if you're gonna dish it out, you better be able to take it. What's your favorite ECW Fine. memory? It's tough to say, you know. Even though the big SOB smushed me, I think me and Bam Bam crashing through the ring left quite an impression. More recently, I think Bobby Lashley... You know, you can show off for the crowd all you want, but all that does is let your opponent rest up. I'm sure this superstar would argue the benefits of feeding off of the audience. Melina may be the cattiest of all the divas in the locker room. She's flat out not to be trusted. Caddy? She's as harmless as a kitten. Puppies! What are you talking about? If I had a buck every time Melina broke a rule, I'd retire early. You'd be out here by yourself. I'll see if I can get that put into your contract after this match then. The match is far from over. But I'm already looking forward to the next time these competitors hook up. Don't count your chickens before they cross the road. By the way, I hate that expression. In Brooklyn, there's no chickens. We got pigeons. I see your point. They've had a lot taken out of them already. This is one of the better matches I've seen in a long time. It certainly is a barn burner, to use a cliche. If I want your opinion, I'll give it to you. You call the action, and I'll give the analysis, and I'll bring the good luck to the table.
Corey's not just a pretty face there, buddy. That girl can go. She sure can. And we're seeing the proof of that here tonight. I don't know if this is such a good move. This could be disastrous. In your experience, what was most, how humiliating to get hit with your own signature move like that? From Diva Search winner to Playboy cover girl, Ashley's done it all. Uh, this is going to be big, one way or the other. God, I'll tell you, I hate to say it, there sure are a lot of ugly fans in the crowd tonight. What'd they do, get a bunch of tickets for your family or something? Ouch! Somebody woke up on the wrong side one, of the bed this morning. Two, hey, I'm just worried three. about the production staff. If the cameras don't break, they're going to just have to spend more time blurring out these ugly faces. Here are your winners. Candace, Michelle, Tori, Wilson, and Kelly. Kelly.